Hello, in this multi-device resolution video, we're going to show you how to set up your Cocos 2DX JavaScript project to use the multi-device resolution philosophy that we're teaching throughout this series. We're not going to discuss what the philosophy is or how to essentially create your assets and position them or anything like that because that's all covered in separate videos, so check them out. This is simply just to get your project set up and you ready to go. So what you want to do is go to your main.js file. It's really simple what you need to do. First of all, create a variable which is is underscore landscape. You can call it whatever you want really, but we're just going to call it is landscape. Pretty simple. Set to true if your game is landscape set to false if your game is portrait pretty simple by default Cocos 2DX is portrait I mean landscape and if you want to change it to portrait using iOS you just change it to this I just want to emphasize though I'm doing this on a Mac using Xcode you can do this for Android using Mac Linux or Windows the red the code is exactly the same so we won't need or we won't be creating a video for let's say Eclipse or ADT or anything like Android Studio because it, the code works exactly the same next thing you want to do is just below a just viewport you want to do if is underscore landscape do else and what you're going to simply do is get that, put that there, put another instance here, change this to 1136 by 768, change this to 768 by 1136. So that's almost done. We're just going to change the cc.resolution policy to no border instead of show all. If you want to discover what other resolution policies are available, right click, jump to definition. This is what's great about Xcode. And we're using this one right here because if you just have a quick read, the entire application fills the specified area without distortion, possibly with some cropping while maintaining the original aspect ratio of the application. So that's the one we want. So there we go. There we go. And that's all set up. We got var is landscape equals true. Is land checks if it is landscape. If so, sets the design resolution to 1136 by 768. We have a resolution policy of no border, so there are no black borders or anything like that. You might get some cropping on the background, but we'll have separate videos covering how to get around that being an issue. And the our statement just covers the portrait resolution which is 768 by 1136 again we still have the no border resolution policy that's it for this video if you have any questions feel free to post them on our education platform sonarlearning.co.uk forward slash question.php there'll be a link in the description to that there'll be another link in the description to the github page for this device video tutorial series which will have the resolution not not the resolution sorry the source code from this video plus the source code from all of the videos in this series along with the multi-resolution photoshop templates please rate comment and subscribe as it really does help us understand what you like and what you don't like about the videos and as usual thank you for watching and i hope you have a great day